Hello all you crazy knife nuts. Well, um, today's discussion isn't about knives, um, but you've been teased about it on Instagram, um, but here are my final conclusions. The um, Nipex pliers versus the uh, um, vice grips. So first, small comparison, an average ordinary throwaway uh, spoon. This is a Zebra uh, 701. So you can see these guys are fairly small pliers. Um, so yeah. So what have we learned about these? All right, vice grips. A um, couple of things that are very nice about them. Number one is, you know, they lock. So you can use this as a clamp. You can grab a hold of something, lock it in, and you've got it locked in your vice or your jaws. That's very handy. Also, uh, they have wire cutters or, or cutters in the back here. So you can cut small wires and things, which also uh, make them very handy. Um, you can uh, open and close them with one hand. Uh, and then, of course, the adjustment, you know, you can make the jaws open bigger. Unscrewing this. All right. But the drawback. Um, when these open or even when you're turning a bolt, um, the pressure is the, the locking power is on the top. Um, so as you turn, you're not making it, the, the jaws clinch any tighter. It's as tight as you lock them on. Um, so they can tend to slip. Also, as you open these wider and wider, um, the jaws don't open, um, parallel like they do on the nip X. So if you're going to try to turn something really big, you don't get as good a grip on it. And you can tend to slip off. I have many times. I've carried a mini pair of vice grips like this for many years. Um, and while they will work, they're not quite as handy uh, when you get to the bigger size. Um, so, you know, they're not the best of all worlds, but they do get a lot of work done. Um, I do appreciate, again, the clamping part that you can open something up and clamp it and hold it, and the wire cutters. But for actually um, nuts and bolts, if they're uh, much bigger than this, which isn't even halfway open, they get really hard to grip onto. Because, again, the gripping pressure is only as much as you hold on the bottom jaw. So if you're trying to tighten something, it can tend to slip off. Nipex, um, no wire cutters, um, and they can't lock, but if you're using these for pliers, and I'm going to have a hard time doing this with one hand, even when you have these wide open, you can see the jaws stay parallel. They grip all the way around. So even bigger bolts and fasteners, when you lock on with these, um, you're not going to slip. The also difference is, you notice the top handle is actually the bottom jaw. jaw. So... The harder you twist, or the harder you push, the tighter the jaws actually grab, which actually works pretty well that way. Um, so one thing I found really nice about these, and here's one thing that I can tell you as um, everyday type carry. One thing I've come across a lot is a garden hose fitting, your average outdoor garden hose. How many of you had tried to get a garden hose loose? If you use these vice grips here, you open them up as far as they can go, and again, once you open them way up, the jaws are, you know, at an angle, and they don't grip very well um, and have a hard time. These will open up and grab onto an ordinary garden hose fitting and uh, tighten it up or take it off very easily. So I love that. The other thing nice about these is, you know, they lock in the position that you're using them. So if you have a certain size uh, bolt or not and you lock it in this size they're locked in so what's my conclusion on these um, if you're just using pliers to loosen and tighten fasteners small fasteners I would definitely go with nip -X. Uh, they grab on tight again as you push down or push they get tighter and tighter these, once you open them up past about halfway, they really start to lose their effectiveness. And they don't get any tighter as you're putting pressure on them. 
Um, I carried these for many years, have gotten a ton of work done with them, um, and I like that, but for just using them as pliers, these work pretty well. Now, I didn't mention any of the multi-tools like Leatherman or that, um, because honestly, I don't have a lot of experience with them. But I think um, for actually taking on and off fasteners, these are still going to win. Because the Leatherman and Type are going to open up the same as these do. Anyway, let me know what you think in the comments below. But uh, I really do love these Nipex. They have found a, a new place in my EDC gear. They might even start going into leather case that these vice grips have lived in for many years. So, anyway, hope you have a great day and let me know what you think.